Hey guys, um, this week we've had a few issues with the lathe. Um, I've been putting some posts up on Instagram about it. Um, basically the live axis is completely dead. We've been having like a servo error for ages. Um, yeah, so we need to work out ways around our, our problems really. Uh, traditionally, so we make these rods and what happens is that when we make these rods we do this on a live axis so it gets machined in our in our um, 5C collet, the live axis would normally drill a 2.5mm hole in the side and then use the 8mm mm and do a slot this side and a slot this side. Now, because the live axis is dead, I have to try and work out how I'm going to do this. And what I've decided to do is take the um, chuck that we've got, fit the 8mm mm mill in that and use an adjustable height tool holder that we've got for the OD term tool luckily the rods are basically fit perfectly in these blocks and I can set up a repeatable job where we can actually then mill by using the chuck so hopefully we can get it get around the issue for now because it's going to be about two weeks before I have to come and actually fix the live axis um, yeah so we'll see how we get on watch the video So guys, I have it all working as it should be. We've got our rods, um, so front and back. I have to do it in two ops, so essentially rotating this round um, manually. But it's not too bad. Uh, it takes probably about three minutes, um, start to finish, to do this to do this op. It's probably about as long as the original program was, but we're not doing our two five drill, so we're missing that and. I guess the only trouble is, is that I'm having to actually, you know, be inside the machine to do this, whereas normally we would just load the rod and press cycle start and walk away from it. One of those things. But at least we've adapted and overcome and we've got around the problem and we can get on and machine these. So that's great.